The following knot was tied in a sample of Rio's 10-pound steelhead salmon tippet material and tested on our Instron machine to illustrate its relative breaking strength. The surgeon knot is a great knot for joining together two bits of line, tippet to leader, two bits of tippet, whatever. Uh, you can tie two twists, three twists, four twists into it, make a double surgeon, a triple surgeon, or quadruple surgeon. That's per individual preference. So very simply, you start off by having your two materials like this with the ends pointing in opposite directions. And you overlap them by about six inches on each, either side. And I like to kind of create a long droopy moustache. Pull them down like this, getting the tags about even here. Then if you're right-handed, pinch it in the middle, and with your left hand, you can slide your hand down towards the end of the tippet material, and you just roll them over to create a crossed loop like this. And then, quite simply, you're going to pull both these tags on the right-hand side through. Now, I like to utilize these fingers here to hook them. Grab them there, and I put my finger in and just pull through like that. I find that a really quick way into here. Grab, see, I can, I can quite easily catch that in rather than try and find it and thread it through. And if I stop there and tightened it now, that's a double surgeon. If I want a little more strength in my knot, I'm going to go around one more time, pull through and make a triple surgeon. And then as you pull this thing tight, you'll find that that knot will start to try and pull into a figure of eight. Boom. And once you get that figure of eight shape, that's the point where you want to moisten the knot or use a little chapstick, whichever you're preferences to tighten up a knot. And then you just go to hold all four ends and carefully pull this knot all the way until it's locked. So that's the triple surgeon. And that's tied in that red and yellow stuff so you can see it. Here's what it looks like in regular 10 pound material that uh, is cinched down with the tags chopped off, nice and neat. And one other advantage of this, apart from joining two bits of material together, I use this to add a dropper. I'm a big fan of fishing teams of flies. So I like to fish two flies, three flies, five flies. Um, so to do that, basically you take the same knot, and instead of chopping off both tag ends, you just chop off one tag. And in advance of tying this knot, you ensure that you leave the tag you're not going to chop off long enough to tie a second fly onto. And you always want this to be the downward tag because when you're fighting a fish, here's the rod pulling up, here's the fish pulling down, you're tightening the knot up. I've seen a few people who tie this when I've kind of been teaching them and learning this, and they leave the upward tag. And if you have the upward tag, when you're fighting the fish, you're going to tear the knot open. So it's a lot weaker. So leave the downward tag for your strength. Leave it long enough to tie your second fly on. And that is the double or triple surgeon. On a single Instron test, this knot broke at 7.03 pounds, which equates to 66% of the tinsel strength of the nylon it was tied in. Rio, make the connection.